All this month at Appalachian Wireless, get the only truly water-resistant Android smartphone, the Samsung Galaxy S7, for just $99.99, and get a second one free. While supplies last, service agreement is required. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. Building a healthier, stronger community while raising awareness and showing support. That was the message Saturday during CrossFit Experience workout. July marks the kickoff for March of Dimes fundraising. CrossFit Experior in Pikeville teamed up with the March of Dimes to host a fundraiser and hopefully raise awareness. Complications that arise from premature birth are among the leading causes of death for infants in the United States. CrossFit would like to help fund research to prevent another family from having to go through that heartache. March of Dimes is very special to my wife and I and our family in general. Two years ago, my wife was pregnant. She gave birth to twins. One of them was stillborn. The other was very sick and stayed about three months in NICU. Every September, the March of Dimes hosts a fundraiser walk. March for Babies funds research, supports families, and helps women have full-term pregnancies. Last year I was really excited to do it, but I wasn't in the emotional space yet to be able to be around that many people and discuss these issues because it was so recent for me that it had happened, but this is a way for me to give back and to be around people who already support me and who already know my story. Even though the March of Dimes is special to those at CrossFit, CrossFit hosts other fundraisers as often as possible, which helps the community in more ways than one. That's what we're trying to do, is to create a culture of fitness in this area and to change the way that people think about how they live their lives, to give them a better quality of life so everyone benefits from it all around. The Central Appalachia March for Babies will be held in Pikeville September 24th. Reporting in Pikeville for EKB News, I'm Shelby Steele.